Hey guys, I'm LB, and I'm very tired right now, but let's check out Fast Minded by Stract. Difficulty, Big Boys Only. Puzzle by Red Silencer, Hammerized by Stract. This puzzle is a redesigned version of a puzzle by Red Silencer, which itself is a remake of Quick-Witted Redux, a puzzle by Brave. Special thanks to those people, see also those maps. Don't download just because you can't solve it. If you get stuck, watch the solution video by Rectorox, which hopefully I won't get stuck, but... As I said, I am tired. I've been trying to fix my sleep schedule. I got 10 hours of sleep last night, but I kept waking up and tossing and turning, so I'm tired. I'm tired right now. Look at that. Isn't that just a beautiful scene right there? That is definitely a good indicator of the quality map-making skills that Stract has. Absolutely beautiful. Very nice work. Right, now on to the actual map itself. So we got a funnel, and... I don't think I've played any of the maps that this is based on. We have this little area here, which... I guess we could, like, strafe out of the funnel to fall into this area, so that's something worth considering. We have... a laser receiver that is not activated right now, or something. Not sure how that's gonna work. I'm not sure... how these ant lines are connected, but let's see. Okay, so it does do all of those things. And it should also... yes, it also unreverses the funnel. And it also does... this, which is a portal surface... interesting. It, you can almost shoot on it as it finishes the animation, but not really. Huh. And then there's this. Oh, this is automatic, okay. Good to know. We have a light bridge over there, we have a laser here. Yada yada. And I guess to get up back to this platform, we just use that portal surface. What about this? Okay, that would allow us to cross, as would that. But that looks like it's another flip panel. I gotta say that it's really cool to see these thin strip, uh, thin, uh, what do you call it? Thin flip panels. Right, yes, I'm tired. I wanna get that in B mod, that would be really cool. Abstract and Team Spin have their agents contact each other. They'll, they'll have Strax people, we'll talk to Team Spin's people, and they'll- they'll work something out. Hmm... Well, that's interesting. What would we want that for? Huh. And there's also that down there, which we'd hit with that portal surface. Uh-huh. Let's go investigate this area. There's a button, a pedestal button that we can press. Also, I thought I saw so yeah, what is that about? Can we, like, jump into that? We'll probably just die, but I do want to test. Whee! Oh yeah, we just fall through it. Come on! <laughs> I wanted to jump into it. Now let's see if the music continues playing when I load my quick save, as a proper hammer mapper would program it to. Nope. It seems the music is no longer playing, so we gotta restart. I'm disappointed in you, Stract. Not really, but... I would like to see more Hammer Map Makers try and script the music to continue playing after a uh, quick save. I mean, after dying or whatever. You know what I mean. So let's go back in there. Get right back in on the horse. Alright, so. Light bridge, light bridge. Let's walk all the way across here. Aha! I see, I see. Wee! Oh, that almost knocked me off. <laughs> that was scary. Right, well, we got a cube now. That's quite an ordeal to go through just to get a cube, isn't it? Makes me think that respawning it might not be so feasible. Also, what the heck is going on with the shadows on this poor cube? Shadows are like all sorts of weird flickering myths. Ah, that's just probably my graphic settings. Or a limitation of the engine, who knows. Right, so that's done. Oh that oh that changes I didn't even notice that. That changes which fizzler is active. Yeah. 
the reason this light bridge is redrawing is because the length of it is changing. And every time the light bridge's length changes, it has to completely redraw the light bridge. And the light bridge can only be drawn... Uh, a segment at a time each frame, so one segment per frame. And that's why it takes so long. So if I set... let's see... FPS Max 1, for instance... This is gonna run terribly, but you'll get the point. What I'm trying to say here. Come on. So now the light bridge should draw one frame at a time. Yep, look at that. It's drawn one frame at a time, one segment at a time. Yep. Now, back to FPS Max 30. There we go. Back to playability. Yep. Demonstration complete. Tutorial completed. Whatever you want to call it. Let's see. All we want to do is that exactly. Let's go find out what the laser receiver does. Looks like it activates another funnel, I guess? Right above the button, too. Interesting. Ooh. Now, isn't that interesting? Oh, and it, it- it funnels it back down before turning off. That is very interesting. Huh. How would we use that, though? <laughs> hmm. What is this platform down here for? Not much, I guess. I wonder if I'm supposed to do something during that time, but I don't know what I would do, is the thing. I have a portal there, but... To what avail? I can't really use that unless I get into that funnel. Hmm... I have some ideas. Not a lot, but some. Let's start by doing... that. And that. Yeah, go ahead and take that from me, please. line up with the cube, does it? No, it doesn't. Yeah, that doesn't line up at all. <laughs> so much for that theory. Yep. Pretty much. At the very least, we get to see whatever this does. I'm pretty sure it opens the exit, right? I should have tried this a long time ago, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this opens the exit. Yep, that is the exit requirement right there, in the flesh and blood. Hmm. We could somehow get on the light bridge and do this. Huh.
problem is we lose access to the laser by preemptively putting the cube on here, so... We also, when we have the cube on here, it closes that portal, so... Hmm. We put this, like, near the funnel so it gets picked up. I'm not convinced that's intended, but I will try it. We'll see what kind of anti-unintended measures have been put in place for that. Oh, this is interesting. Can we actually shoot a portal through here? Yes, we can! Interesting, I didn't even think to come over here. Yeah, okay, so that's something to keep in mind. Is that a target on thing? No, that's just lights. Okay. Thought I saw a target. Yeah, we can't actually see what we want to see from here. We can see that now. That does do that thing that I said it would do. And again, I'm not certain how intended that is. It honestly seems a little bit unintended, honestly. Hmm. Hey! What's up here? This little... Easter egg area? Neat. Hehehehehe. <laughs> Well, this is neat. Um, it's a good place. Sure, we'll cover up the posters with it. Am <laughs> I some kind of idiot? <laughs> Why didn't I think of that so much sooner? I can just leave the cube on the button, as it is right now. Right? I can just, like, hand place it on the button. I can shoot the light bridge there. And then I can just walk through that portal. <laughs> That's definitely much more intended than what I had in mind. Yeah, look at that. Check that out. Alright, then... What do we do next? Something like that, maybe? Oh! I know what I needed to do. Alright then. Let's try this again. There is a reason that that allows us to light bridge ourselves upward. Uh huh. Yeah, let's do this again. Close enough. So yeah, now we get access to the funnel. Hmm, but the issue is the issue is Can't actually do anything with it now. I mean I guess if we shoot the green portal it'll pull us back over to the laser, but that's about it. If we shoot the black portal, it does basically nothing for us. green portal there... maybe... maybe... Maybe we can launch ourselves across the safety. Not entirely sure how just yet, but we'll figure it out, I'm certain.
Also, I still need to figure out... when we're gonna use that fall. Like, I'm sure we could jump from there into the portal surface, and that would come in handy at some point. Maybe we can come out of that and strafe into the funnel? Not entirely sure yet. So let's try this strategy first. Okay, that gets us over here. We have a portal on both sides. So can we just take the cube through? Yeah, looks like we can. So now we have the cube on this side, right? So there's that much done, at the very least. Hmm... So now our goal is gonna be to get the laser, right? What might be the best way to go about doing this? Can we jump in that from here? I don't know if this is high enough to get us into the funnel. It doesn't look like it. It doesn't... look like it. I think that's actually lower down or at the same height as that. So... yeah. Huh. Either way, right now it's a game of portal management. I mean, it's worth a shot, right? Oh wait, that does get us in there! Huh. That did not work out like I expected it to, but I'm glad it did work out, at the very least. Mm, now what? Hmm... We could potentially go and try and respawn the cube. I'm not sure how useful that would be. Still need to figure out what that's all about. Hmm. access that area. And then it would pull us back... across. We wouldn't be able to get up here anymore, if we did that. And then we wouldn't be able to use that. But with things the way they are right now, we can't actually get back into that room without crossing the Fizzler. Or unreversing, I mean, rever reversing the funnel. So I think we do have to respawn the cube. I'm just not sure what that's for yet. We might have to put the cube back on that button again. Yeah, yeah, because that that's our exit requirement. We have to have a cube on the button in order to exit. Yeah, so... Huh. And that does basically nothing, yeah. Right. In this case... Let's go on across here and see what all we need to do here. I think we should be able to just... Ah, yes, that's why that cube goes on such a weird route. So that we can catch it in the act. Yep, that caught the cube alright. Now the question is... Do we want it there, or do we want it in the funnel? I honestly am not sure. And that- that background there, that still looks amazing, by the way. It is definitely... Definitely amazing. Whoever made that definitely has an eye for art. 
I can still see that from here, so I'm good. Yeah, there's no chance of me getting up in here. Not that I would want to, really, because I don't think that would do anything for me. I already, already used that. I don't think I don't think we need to use it again. We might, but I'm not so sure. This is scary walking on here like this. Wait, hold on a second. Is this a slight oversight? I mean, not really, but still. <laughs> it seems like you'd want to walk over there. I guess it doesn't matter since this is the same connected platform and we can just walk over here and do it. But yeah, that's not an oversight. That's just an adorable little Easter egg. Oh, and there's glass here, so you can even see that it's down there. That's nice. That's neat. Well, I think having the cube there is not doing us any good, so let's go ahead and, uh, pull it through. But then how do we get up here? That's a good question. Yeah, that's not gonna help us. Hmm. We can't, like... Make a jump for the light bridge funnel thing from here, so that's not gonna help us. Hmm. I wonder if we if we go high enough to then use that with the light bridge? Probably not. But I mean, it's worth a shot, right? No, because then we lose our portal on the other side, so I wouldn't want to do that anyway. Well, this is perplexing. I don't know, let's just pull the cube through, and see if that does anything for us. And just to double check... Yeah, can't stand on that. And definitely can't make that jump in the slightest. So we have the cube all the way over there now. Not doing as much good. We can't get up here as much as we might want to. Can't get into this funnel as much as we might want to. then. Also, I think I shot my black portal in the wrong spot, so let's- let's go back. <laughs> let's control Z real quick. Let's, uh... I don't know, let's do it here. Wait, what if we do it over there? Let's try it over here. See if this does anything for us. That allows us to respawn the cube, right? Yeah. Okay. Come here, cube. So let's put this here again. Still need to find a way to use that somehow. I'm not totally convinced that this is helpful in any way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's not helpful.
really like to be up there. our exit requirement, all right. Can't even see the exit from here, but whatever. this up to this height level. Hmm. I wonder if we could get the light bridge somehow. Either way, as it stands right now, I'm kind of... out of luck. Because I can't really do anything anymore. So, how about... Let's pretend... Let's pretend that I shot my portal over here instead. And that this is how I pulled myself through the funnel, yada yada. I came out of the funnel and I... put the cube on the button and then I did this. Yes. This is a valid state. We have access to this side... We can do this, not that it helps any. Just clears our black portal. We can jump into there again and get back in the funnel if we want. Maybe I missed something when I did it before. Let's try it again. Grading cuts off just so that we cannot shoot a portal there. <laughs> there's even this here to make sure that there's no shooting between the corner glass gap. And we can kind of stand on the edge and shoot a portal here, but I don't think it's going to do us any good, honestly. Bam! Unintended and unhelpful at the same time. Well... I mean, when we're in this funnel, right? We can probably... time a shot... like that. Yeah, that works too, so... Not quite unintended. Just unhelpful. surface. I'm pretty sure we want to have a light bridge there, and then use the lift to ride up and access the light bridge, but... I'm not sure how to even accomplish that in the first place. How do we get on the light bridge... without losing our portals? One cube. Can't really mess with that button at all, unless we're dealing... unless we have the cube, right? Yeah, can't mess with that button unless we have the cube, so... that's out of the question. I 
well, maybe we have to do stuff again like that, or... No, that wouldn't really make much sense. Yeah, cause then we can't have the cube there, to have that accessible. And this light bridge doesn't give us access to the rest of this area. What am I missing? sure pushing us all the way up to this height level doesn't do us any good. And even if we were- even if we had the reverse funnel and we were pulling ourselves back across to there and we dropped out and fell into that... I don't think that would do us any good either. Like, even if we had... Even if we had the cube sucked into the reverse funnel, we wouldn't be able to, to- to grab it. Like, even if we could grab it, we wouldn't be able to throw it to that button, and- and throwing's not intended anyway, so that's out of the question. Huh. Oh man, there's catwalks down there, that's cool. Pretty sure, just for demonstration purposes, if we were to do... If we were to do... this... Yeah, that doesn't help at all, so that's not- that's not helpful. And that's just gonna kill us. That's not helpful. Gets us up to the laser, but then that's it. There's no good way that I can see to get the light bridge without losing a portal on the other side there. But I do feel like respawning the cube must be part of the puzzle at some point or something. At some point or other. I wonder, since I can fall through this, I wonder if I could, like, step on the cube. <laughs> Probably not. But, I do want to test. It'd be kind of hilarious. Okay, well that was a failure. Try again. That was way too early. Still way too early. Oh well that actually killed me this time, so I guess we're gonna lose the music in that case. I didn't- they didn't stop myself in time. It's interesting, I could tap no clip after I died, but I think I might actually tap no clip before I died, but then I coasted into the death barrier, so... This is not me trying to solve the puzzle right now, this is just me messing around, because I can't solve the puzzle. Oh, I- I no-clipped and that would've worked. Still too early. And I died again. I'm still going too early, I need to wait a bit longer. Oh, that's- nope, nope, nope. Walked forward instead of back. Too early. I think it might have bumped me, maybe. Oh, 
Oh, that almost worked. Okay, that's- that's enough of that. <laughs> How about I just manually do it now, so I can... time myself to land on the cube. Hey, it works! You can totally land on the cube! <laughs> yep. Cause the- cause that has no collision, you can just land on the cube. <laughs> if you time it right, unlike me. Okay, so. We have this situation. That's very well aim assisted. We could try and go through there, but I don't think we should. I think we tried it already, in fact. Pretty sure if we're going in this direction, I don't think we can pull ourselves up into that, right? Oh, that actually works. What? That might be unintended. I have a strong suspicion that that is unintended. Oh crap! Well, now I've messed everything up. So let's let's go back to this point. Oop! No, no. Let's go back to this point, right? So I somehow managed to accomplish this, and now let's hold forward. Yes. Okay. That feels... unintended, to say the least. I don't- although I don't think it really helps me much. Honestly. <laughs> Cube. Yeah. Oh, and that's death. Hehehe. <laughs> uh, excuse me. I would like to go through the portal, please. I can't get up here without the cube. Hmm. What else can't I do without the cube? What if I do get up here without the cube, now that the cube is just down here? That still doesn't get me across. Okay, so that's not worth trying. Oh, come on! That's not what I wanted to do. And that thing animates fast, doesn't it? I can do this, I suppose. But that just kind of gets me back to square one now, doesn't it? So what if I leave this cube off of the button? Excuse me, I'm allergic to being stuck in maps. And I could get in the funnel if I wanted to, that's- that's a thing I can do. Can I strafe back onto the platform, though? No, that is not a thing I can do. Alright, lesson learned. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> it launched me in a way I did not expect out of that portal.
I think I know how I'm going about this all the wrong way. Oh, that's gonna kill me. Oh, I hit that. Okay, well, interesting. Let's pretend I didn't die. Okay, so this is the previous state. Doesn't matter that we got it- got here by doing weird stuff. And... How about you let us tomato over this direction? There we go. Let's just go ahead and head and do this stuff. Cause why not? So now we have access to both buttons, right? And we have the cube. Let's see if this does anything for us. Oh right, that gets rid of that portal surface, doesn't it? Haha! <laughs> yeah. Hmm. That means the only way for us to get back in the other room is to jump back into the other room. nice if we could pull ourselves through there to the other room, but I'm not seeing a way to make that happen. Well... At the very least, let's try this. Oh, no, not from here. I guess it doesn't really matter, right? Whee! Yeah, and the funnel's reversed, so that does us no good. But, at least this fizzler is off right now, and we have a portal on both sides. That's a state we have not been in before. I think this might be what I was missing. So, let's try this. What do I actually want to do... now? There's not really a lot that we can do from here, is there? We can shoot a portal on this side, and then when it changes over, we'll shoot a portal, I guess, somewhere on this side, but... I mean, we've, we've been in this particular state before, actually. Yeah. I think I've made backwards progress, actually.
what all can we see from down here? Not much. I think I might have gone backwards in the entire map, honestly. Right. Well then. Back to this date, right? That shit's this. Hmm. There's no hope of me getting up there right now. Put this on here, but that doesn't really do us much good. What the heck is that? It's like... some weird... melted stuff? What is this? I guess it's like a melted... chunk of metal? It's like cables or something. Huh. This looks weird. Curse you, Lightbridge. Having you would solve all my problems. There's no way... to get you... and then get to the other side while maintaining a portal on you. Hmm... I'm pretty sure we can't stand on this either, right? Oh, we can stand on this. Interesting. Although we can't actually jump on it from here, so... Right, the only thing we can do right now is to jump up into the funnel. Yeah, I'm feeling a bit stuck right now. I am certainly... feeling quite a bit stuck. I think I'm missing something... either really obvious or really important, so... This whole time I've been trying to maintain portals across both sides, what if... I stop doing that? I think it'll just... screw me over if I lose the portal to this side, but... Who knows, maybe it's what I have to do. Sure, let's try it. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, 
am not really seeing what to do here now. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm pretty much just screwed at this point. Yep. I think... I... am... screwed. Ah, sure, whatever. And then the same thing on this side, right? Nothing much I can do from here, honestly. I suppose I could lift myself up here for fun. Not that it really makes a difference. Oh, come on! The funnel fits through, why can't I fit through? Oh, that's why. <laughs> okay, sure. You win this time, Stract. Hmm. I'm clueless. So... I think I need to take a break... and peek... at the solution video or something. I'll be right back. Alright. Okay, so... I stopped watching at 2.12, because, uh... that's the part where... we leave the cube on the light bridge. Right? Right? Yes, we leave the cube on the light bridge, and then... And then this is what we're doing in the video, so I'm gonna go from here. I thought there was nothing to be done from leaving the cube on the light bridge, but apparently there is, so... That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna work with that assumption for now. That's the hint I'm gonna take. And... Something, something or other. Mm-hmm, yes. I don't know if I need to go to this room first, or if I need to stop on that side before going through, or... I don't know. I honestly don't know. Right, so, we're here now, right? Blah da blah da blah, there's a cube on the light bridge. Ho oh, hip hip hooray. Huh. I'm not really seeing... that there's much to be done here, honestly. Yeah, I'm not... not really seeing much. And as for this... yeah, I can't really do anything with that right now. Just walk through the portal. Walk through the portal! On all on your own. Nah? No? Okay. Well then. Well then. I think at this point that I'm just really screwed and have to start the whole puzzle over. <laughs> That's what I am seeing. Man, at this point this video is gonna be over an hour long. Two or hour long videos in a row? Come on. Alright, well... Back to thinking I go. Oh, wait, what? Why are you standing on the button to do that? Excuse me? Excuse me, I don't understand. Right, well, let's, uh... Hmm. Let's, let's reset this up the way things were before. So we were over here, we had just stopped the cube on the light bridge, right? And now we're going across. And, uh... 
Apparently we only need it there temporarily. Oh wait, that! Is that at the same height level as the... Yeah, I think it is. But which one? Is it this upper one? I think it's the upper one that's at the same height level. And I always forget that. Right. Does- wait. Does that mean we're gonna pull the cube through the center? But why would we do that? Do we wanna stop it in the center, or do we wanna stop it up there? It's not exactly clear to me, to be honest. Well, I mean... It's doctor's order, so... Let's try it. I mean, the cube's up there now. What good does that do me, though? I think that literally does nothing for me. Why do I want that? I don't understand! That doesn't make any sense to me! Like, would I want to drop it through there, or something? I don't... I don't understand. Do I need it down here with me? I thought I could do this before already. I'm pretty sure that I've had the reverse funnel and the cube there. Maybe I didn't. Is that what I'm trying to do? Is I'm just trying to get the cube to me? Maybe? I don't know, why would I want this, though? Why would I want this? I mean, it's different, I guess I haven't done this before, but... It doesn't seem useful, honestly. Do I want to funnel through there, or through there? See, here, here's the question. How do I get the cube back to the other side now? How do I do such a thing? I mean, I know I'm tired, but surely I'm not this tired. What, what am I possibly missing in my understanding here? I'm going to assume this is what we wanted to do, since I can easily put the cube back in the funnel if we want it up there for some reason. Uh, I'm gonna save here. And let's go through here. Why not? It's not like we can do much else. No, this is not helpful. This is not good. Why did I do this? Yeah, that's- that's not useful. That is not a thing that we need to do. Yeah, because we've been in that state before. We have been in that exact state of the puzzle before. I'm pretty confident in my assessment there. Well, if I forget about portal management for a moment... I suppose... I suppose I could go over here like this. I've lost my portal to the other side, but I can just do that now. And then... Then what? Then what? Then what do I do? Then what do I do? There's no way to get back up there now. I am effectively screwed. I can't get the cube in here now. So there's that much going for us, right? I mean, whoop de doo I have a light bridge on that side, hooray! I could have done this ages ago, I think I have made backwards progress in this puzzle again. Yep, I think I have indeed made backwards progress. I definitely, definitely think I've been able to do this before.
Hmm. Yes, I have made backwards progress. I think I need to jump off. I think I definitely need to keep portals on both sides, but I don't understand what to do from this point. Like, normally when I get a little hint from a video, I know exactly what I need to do next, because it, like, it helps everything click, like it's something I wouldn't have tried, and yeah, I guess I wouldn't have tried this, but I don't see how this helps me, I don't see what the next move is. And I almost feel like I've done this before. Like, am I going crazy or something? Okay, that- that didn't work that time. Let's try this again. How do I- how did I do it before that it worked so well? Man, that's- that's not right. Well, that- that just knocks me out entirely. No, that- okay, I think the one time I did it was a fluke, and I think it's not supposed to work. Pretty sure... Pretty sure this whole situation right now was not useful. Right, back to the video, I guess. So let's see. Oh, right, let me, let me mute that. You gotta- if you wanna listen to the audio, you gotta go watch Rectorox's video. Go watch it. I'll put a link in the card. Yeah, so you get it here, and then what do you do with it? Wait, what? Oh, come on! That's not nice! Why would you do that? I mean, I know I do that all the time, but come on! That's not something that should be required in a map. I disagree, sir. I disagree. N I, when I'm looking for intended solutions, this is not something that comes to mind to do. Generally, I consider this to be unintended. Just jumping on cubes in general is unintended, in my opinion. Wait, what good- what good does this do me? Hold on a sec. Stop. Why am I doing this? Cuz I can already do what I've done here. I don't understand. This makes no sense. Why am I doing this? Rector Rocks, why am I doing this? Tell me why I'm doing this. Why am I doing this? I don't understand. It makes no sense. Why am I doing this? I have to go all the way through? But I've done that before! I've had this exact situation before! That makes no sense! No wait, no, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet. Don't wanna go with IQ. Uh... Why, though? It what I don't understand! <laughs> Wait, was I supposed to stay in the funnel? No, okay. Where did you put the funnel? I mean, where'd you put the cube? Where did you put the cube? Hold on a sec, what'd you do with it? Oh, you put it on there, okay, gotcha. But why, though? Wait, what? Couldn't I have done this earlier? How did I... I guess because I didn't have a portal there? Man, this whole time I thought I needed a light bridge to do this! Have I mentioned I'm bad with funnels, guys? Okay, but still... I still don't know what that's for, though! Like, I can get there now! But I still don't know what it's for! I have no idea! No idea what it's for! I mean, I can get there now, but... What the heck am I supposed to do here, though? Oh, and that's- that's an absolutely amazing, amazing thing I just did there. You guys, you wouldn't understand, you have to have a really high IQ. I've- I've manipulated the RNG so that, uh, speedrun strats, you know. 
None of this makes any sense. None of this makes any sense. Herp derp, I can walk over there now, I guess. Oh, that's all I need to do, huh? Man, this is- this is- this map was like, not compatible with my brain. This is one of those maps... that... halfway through, every move, every single move doesn't make sense. It's been a long time since I played one of those maps. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I'm- I'm done now. I know! I know, you can stop shouting at me. Yes, I know. But holy crap, man, this- This was something, wasn't it? Like, just the fact that all these things... That in this order... Like, in order to get here, like, once I get to this point, stuff starts making sense again, but... I swear, the last several things we did made no sense, and I never would have tried them, so yeah, this map, I never would have solved it... ...without the help of my good friend, Rector Rocks. So thank you for that, Rector Rocks. I appreciate it. But holy crap, man, Red Silencer, you've made quite a map here, and Strax has hammerized it quite well. Alright, so... And the nice thing is, the way I had my portals ended up... That it goes into the black portal and comes out of the green portal just the way I like it. <laughs> oh man, alright, well. As always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!